hey good morning so i did a video earlier and i was like that was gonna be my video for the day and god said no because the video was like 30 seconds long i'm gonna still put that video up on my instagram page so if you're not following me go to ig tanisha shanae to see that video 30 seconds um but today i really it was as i was driving to work um the one thing that because the video that the message that was placed on my heart this morning was about mistakes and you know oftentimes i'll hear people whether it's my students it's someone in the street it's a client you know you read facebook posts instagram posts and people will comment about things that are happening in their lives and they'll feel as though that you know i made one mistake in my life so everything is just done mistakes mistakes are going to happen they're gonna happen they're just like problems they are a form of a problem and what did i tell y'all before the two things that are guaranteed in life we have death so we're all gonna die we all know this and we know that there's gonna be a lot of problems big problems small problems somebody woke up this morning and had a problem i woke up this morning and i had a problem right i had two problems actually the first problem was i didn't have any gas right i only had a quarter not a quarter i forgot how much gas i didn't have a lot Right. I was I wasn't even at a quarter of a tank. That was a problem. Now, would I did I allow that to disrupt me to to take over my day to to control how my day went? No, I can't do that. That's not possible. Um because I have to make sure that I stay focused, right? So many times we are distracted by the problems or the mistakes or the issues that are going on around us that we're not paying attention to the blessings that are trying to come forth. Um, when your energy is interrupted, when your your spirit is compromised because you have allowed it, right? And I used to do that. I used to allow when my spirit gets compromised, I was just like shut down. And sometimes we're shutting down at the wrong time. Sometimes it's not the time for you to shut down. So you are going to have to stay focused. You're going to have to start identifying ways to find solutions to these problems. These problems should not stick to you for a long time. They are going to, yes, you're going to have a reaction. Absolutely, right? React. Feel the way that you want to feel, whether it's just blowing or it's just, you know, crying or, you know, don't punch anything. Don't hurt yourself. But you can experience that feeling for that moment and then move forward move forward there's nothing else that you can do move forward what are you going to sit here and do you're going to be upset you're going to you're going to have you're going to just allow the rest of the day to go and you're going to be sitting here just mad at the world how is that going to benefit you how is that one mistake going to help help you for the rest of your day how are you going to achieve your goals these are just questions I want you to think about. I want you to really think about how am I going to accomplish all that I am set to accomplish if I keep allowing these mistakes and these problems to take over and to, to allow my energy to go from zero to a negative because you're not even at 100. You're at a negative at the end of the day. So I just want to encourage you. I want you to know like there are things out there that no matter what, they're going to come up. Find a way to solve and address those and address those problems with solutions. Let's get solution driven and not only focusing on the problems. Problems happen every single day. You're gonna have a problem later on today, but how are you going to handle that? I am Tanisha Shanae, Miss Inspiration. Have an amazing day today. Have a good one.